Hey, so um, this is my new channel um, called Sharpener Paradise, where I will be reviewing pencil sharpeners and stuff. Yes, I am a collector. I currently have my others in storage, but I have just ordered a new one today, oh man. And yes, I am Sifton Man 9 I am the guy who does toilets in public. Um, I also... I was the one who also uploaded that Yandere Simulator um, gaming video. Um, I'm also the guy who did the GMA movies and stuff. I'm also the one who uh, uploaded the Amar Azul and Fidoni Bares music. But um, anyway, so but this channel is gonna be about pencil sharpeners. So today I have this good-looking Staples pencil sharpener. Focus, you son of a gun. Focus. Focus! There it is, it says Staples, um... And this is the Staples, I believe, is it medium duty pencil sharpener? Um, yeah. Um... Let's take a look inside. This is my first video, so we expect it not to be that great. Uh, at least on this channel. I don't know if y'all can see that on there, but... Yup. That's the steel cutter. Feels kind of gritty, too. Um, That's where the pencil would go. Um, and maybe about a... Maybe a... Probably say about maybe a, an 8 to 10 feet cord. Um, Little nice plug-in adapter right here, classical on most pencil sharpeners these days. Um, and okay, let's take a look at the model information. I'm only gonna read the English part because I don't know French and that other stuff. Come on, focus. Okay, hold on, I'm gonna do something. I'm gonna grab my pencil box, just to add support to it. It's better. Focus. Focus! You damn thing. Product support, made in China, electric pencil sharpener, um, and I believe this uses an AC motor, I think. Staples, um, model number 21835, 120 volt, 60 hertz, 2 amps. Okay, so there's that. Alright, um, so... I'm just gonna go ahead and get this thing plugged in. Oh crap, I don't want you guys to see my face. Sorry. Yeah, I actually, hold on guys, I'll be right back. Okay, so I just have plugged it in. I have tested it just to make sure the motor runs and it does, okay. And I did get this one from a friend too. So I'm gonna be sharpening all of these pencils today. Seven pencils. Okay, so let's go ahead and do this. Three. Oh, crap. Two. One. Ah, he needs more. All right, that's one. Let's go two. Dead. 
Damn it. Okay, this one turned out all badly sharpened. Damn it. Okay. Get off, you son of a gun. I'm gonna have to sharpen this pencil all over again. Because it just shouldn't have turned out like that. Like, okay. If you have more lead, okay, or let's say you have all lead on one side and the other side, when you're like drawing and stuff, it won't be able to like, it won't work right, you know? Okay, I'm just gonna set the camera down. I have moved the mirror out of the way for the video. Put my freaking camera down. Oh, and I knew it. I just knew it. I just knew it. I just knew it. Okay. I'm gonna have to do it the hard way then. <laughs> just do this. Find for support. Hopefully this temper really works. Okay, let's do this. Okay, I put a candle right there, so I hope it's not in the way. Anyways, um, let's go ahead and finish it off the pencils. Okay, I'm just going to count this one sharpened. It's all badly sharpened, so it's going to go on the other end of the table. Right. Two, one. Okay, it's running. It's running kind of slow. This one turned out better. I don't know if y'all can see that. Get it closer to the camera. Now, okay, I take that as a yes. It's been sharpened. So that's two good sharpened pencils. We're gonna sharpen a completely unsharpened one right here. It's three, two, one. <laughs> Okay, another badly sharpened pencil. That's two. I have lowered the rating again. This one, you, this one could at least use a little. Hmm. Okay, this is our third good pencil. We have two more. So we have two bad sharpened ones and then two, um, Good sharpened pencils. This one is dull as heck right here. Let's do this one. And wow, this one has been sharpened like very good. Sometimes, you know, you can have um, pencils that just get eaten up by the sharpeners because um, usually one of the main reasons was because... Uh, there's actually some like type of glue that like holds the graphite onto the little tube that's right in the wood, um, and like if that area is loose, um, it's just either the lead can like get jammed up in there or the sharpener will just keep sharpening the pencil until it's like down to the bare minimum length. And that's not good. Usually that indicates that you would need a new pencil, not a new sharp wait. Okay, I'll shut up. Last pencil, here we go. <laughs> And this one turned out to be good. All right, so. Okay. Okay. So these are all the goodly sharpened pencils. There's that. All right, and these are the bad ones right here. And you'll be able to see why too. Yeah, just didn't sharpen right. Anyways, um, so 
overall rating, I'm probably going to maybe give it maybe a 7 out of 10, just because it sometimes, like, doesn't sharpen things right, and you have to, like, keep doing it constantly until the pencil at least gets the amount you want. But, it, but then again, it can just, like, eat up the whole pencil. Well, you can probably wind up having the sharpener eating up the whole pencil, too, which, then again, there's that. But other than that, I'd probably say it's not an excellent sharpener. Yeah, it's a great sharpener, um, but... Would I recommend it? I'd probably say it's up to you for your recommendations. Um, and the motor barely got hot. Like it's not even hot at all. Other than that, um, this is Sharpener Paradise. Hope y'all enjoyed the video. Like and subscribe, hit that notification bell, and peace out.